All right, coming up next, the main event, a matchup for the UFC lightweight division title. contender making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. Challenges get stiffer. Can he remain the hunted? Several championship fights to his credit, a lot of 25 minute wars. As he gets older, the challenges get stiffer. We'll see how he handles this one tonight. for this, our main event of the evening. The American is 27, the Russian is 29. Lee will have a seven inch reach advantage. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC lightweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 18 wins, seven losses. He stands five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, presenting the challenger, Kevin, the Motown Phenom Lee. And now introducing the champion, Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 24 wins, one loss. He stands five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Mexicala, Russia, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, is Gotcha! All right, this is for the championship. You can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, just make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Hey. round one in DC, I know you have said to anyone within earshot, if you like grappling, this is the matchup for you. This is the matchup for you. You may as well be in the gymnasium somewhere watching the jiu-jitsu right, or right. combat sambo competition because these guys are trying to both get the fight to the floor and they're trying to get bragging rights because no one has the accomplishments of these two in the grappling room. So if one of them can secure a submission, it only will add to their legacy inside of the grappling room. And of course, if there's someone who likes the striking game, uh, maybe we'll our next one. Yes. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. 
All right, so once again, the fighters engage in the clinch. We'll see who will have the upper hand here, champ. There are so many options. Oh! Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. Holding on to him. That's a perfect scramble right there. Beautiful transition. Right punch is good. The left also flush. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Left hand punch. Oh, good opportunity to do damage here. He's got that tie clinch. Oh, now he's got the tie plum, Daniel. If you're on the other side, what are you trying Double to do? Double leg. And potentially a critical takedown here. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. All right, working inside the closed guard now. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Left hand punch for the clinch. Oh, big knee. Oh! Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. Oh, nice. Inside the closed guard of his opponent here, DC. You gotta be careful. Five minutes in the books. All right, so there's the end of the round. A lot of high level action. And if you like the takedown game, as my boy Daniel Cormier does, you enjoyed that round. It's like we're watching the NCAA wrestling tournament. It's takedown after takedown. He's fighting his fight. He's able to change level, drive into his opponent, and secure takedown after takedown. All right, here we go. Next round is underway. Thought we might see a finish in the previous round. Had a submission attempt, but was unable to Wasn't able to finish the fight. Credit to his opponent. Had a really, really good submission defense. Great punch, man. So much power. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy tonight. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also very fast. Look at the hand speed, right? Oh, beautiful jab by him there, really taking advantage of what is an obvious edge and reach. Takedown defense holds up. Wow. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no slow, and he hip tosses him to the mat. Now we'll see what he can do from here, DC. Right into side control. He's gonna try to control him, then find a submission. All right, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Well, he's more than content to work off of his back, DC, where he has been a magician in his UFC career. He might get a finish here. Oh, countering, it looks like with a bomb flu choke. Maybe we should call it the OSP now, but trying to get out of the guillotine by submitting his opponent. Incredible. it done by submission tonight, champ. He does a great job of staying patient. He doesn't rush or panic. You are never safe when you're fighting this guy. You're in a lot of trouble. 
you're in a lot of trouble the entire time when you're this good in the submissions. So there is the man they are all chasing at 155 pounds, the undisputed UFC lightweight champion. And how about the way he got it done tonight? A spectacular submission to finish the job. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines going to stop this contest at 2 minutes, 29 seconds of round number 2. For the winner by submission, and new UFC lightweight champion of the We got a new UFC lightweight champion. This is a belt that doesn't always change hands very often. There's a new king at 155 pounds. The most exciting moment in sports when Dana White wraps the belt around a new champion's yes. waist. Take a moment, son. Breathe it in. You are now the best fighter in the world.